We're here with Greg Miller, head coach of the men's basketball team here at Trinity International, whose team is 2-0 and through their first two games of the year and will open conference play tonight. Coach, thanks for joining us. Appreciate it, Joel. First things first, got to start off with that win the other night at Lincoln Christian. A 58-point second half, 12 steals, and a 97-74 win. How do wins like that build your team's confidence? You know, anytime you can go on the road early in the season, that'll build your team's confidence. But the second half, I really thought we, we fell back on who we are. Uh, we want to pressure the ball. We want to get out in transition. We want to attack the rim. And then ultimately, doing all that creates shots for our shooters. So very pleased with our second half effort after kind of a slow start in the first half. You opened on December 30th at Lincoln, and it was kind of a back and forth game, which resulted ultimately in a five point win to open the year. With limited practice to prepare, what's your thinking been towards game preparation? You know, we just want to prepare the guys as best we can for any situation that we're going to see. And we had three days of practice before that first game. And so we left some stuff out going into that first game because we would rather be good at a few things than just be average at everything. And so going into that game, they made a couple adjustments that honestly we were not prepared for as a team. We had to talk through them at timeouts, at half times. And ultimately, our guys are able to perform those on the floor after just talking about them. So very pleased. Once again, Lincoln's a really good team. That's a great win on the road. Um, you know, if we can build off that and get close wins on the road, you know, I'm, I'm very pleased. You've gotten some good play out of Brandon Lawani and Brandon McQueen, who didn't play much last year. What's their impact been through the first two games? Oh, it's it's been a huge impact. Obviously, Brandon Lawani had the ankle injury last year, redshirted, so we didn't have him. Just his presence on the court, let alone in the paint, has been huge for us, rebounding defensively. And then offensively, I'm looking right now, he's 58% from the field. So we love having that back out there. And then Brandon McQueen, you know, once we once we got him back out, you know, he missed the second semester last year. Um, his explosiveness offensively, as well as his maturity and leadership, is just something you can't measure. Conference play opens tonight, Olivet Nazarene and Governor State this Saturday. Uh, Olivet, the reigning regular season champions in the league from last year. Do you think these first two games that you've played so far is going to prepare you for this tough slate? Yeah, I hope so. Honestly, I don't know if there is a good way to prepare for Olivet. You know, they are explosive offensively. They do what they do. They're going to throw it inside. They've got one of the best bigs in the nation in Alex Gross. So once again, you know, if you don't have 6'10", you can't necessarily prepare for 6'10", and that's what he is. Um, so I think we're prepared. We'll find out. It's a great early season test. We'll see where we're at. Uh, we'll see what we need to get better at. They will expose some things on us, but we're just looking forward to competing. 